Hello everyone and welcome back. We're here today to show you this bad boy, the Q-Series K6090 CNC. This has a whole host of upgrades we've added to it. You've got a brand new controller, an LED work light, an air blower. You can also upgrade this to have the 250mm Z-axis, a 1200mm long bed. You can have a lathe axis, an auto tool change function, a vacuum table. You can have it surrounded in an enclosure. You can have it on the bench that you can see here today. So uh, let's show you how she works. So here, as you can see, we've got a few examples today that we can show you the capabilities of the 3D machining. We've got that in solid walnut there. As you can see, non-ferrous metals aren't a problem for this machine either. Brass, copper, aluminium. And here you can even see the function of the lathe axis. Making this a hugely versatile machine. So here you can see our upgraded NK105 G2 controller. With this controller, you can adjust the machine manually so you can plot your coordinates. You've all, you can also adjust the feeds and speeds manually whilst the program is running. It's got an internal memory so you can store your programs on there if you're doing repeat work. All of these yellow buttons around the side here are for your manual movements as you can see. The X axis, Y axis and Z axis can all be controlled on this controller. You can set your zero positions on this, run your programs, pause, and stop them and resume from where you left off. So down here you can see the main electrical cabinet for the CNC. You've got your inverter display which shows the frequency in Hertz. The on and off button for everything including the water cooled pump which is for the water cooling spindle. You can also opt for an air cooled spindle in, with this machine. You've got the on and off switch for the vacuum pump, your emergency stop and then down on the side you have your main isolator a socket so you can pop your vacuum pump in and a socket for your water pump as well. So it's fully contained within the machine, meaning you only need one power supply for the whole entire machine. So on the side here you can see you have your USB port. This is where you plug your USB stick in which contains all of your programs and as stated before you can store programs on the main controller to use again at a later date. And around the front here is your inverter screen for your variable frequency drive. This allows you to adjust your spindle speed up to 24,000 RPM. So the machine is equipped with a, an auto measuring tool sensor. So this measures the tool length, so you can set your Z0 position to wherever it matches on your program. Simply press the buttons on the controller. You will see the tool comes down, touches the sensor, it will lift back up, and then your Z0 position is set. And that's it. So on the controller is where you choose your programs to run, go into your local files, find the program that it is that you're going to run, press the OK button and you have a little tick next to it, press number one to load and then you're ready to press play straight away.
So now the first process is done, we're going to change our tool for the second tool path. Uh, it's a super easy process, you're going to watch me do it now. Simply use the two spanners that come with the machine. Undo your tool. Then you have a collet. That one was suited for that tool. The machine comes with three collets as standard, which are three mil, six mil, and 12 mil. Put your tool in. Most of the tools come with a line that tells you how far in they need to go. Tighten it up, and then we're ready to remeasure it. So we'll use the tool measure, put it back on top of our work surface, and run the tool measure process. And now we're ready to run the second part of our program. So there you have it, that was the Q-Series K6090 desktop CNC. We have shown you only a small fraction of what the machine is capable of. If you want to do intricate work on non-ferrous metals, hardwoods, softwoods, plastics, the sky is the limit. If you have any questions or you want to see a demonstration of the machine, you're welcome to visit us, give us a call or drop us an email.